Discover the future of hospitality management with the cloud-based solution offered by Global Edgelink. Introducing Opera PMS Cloud. Move beyond the limitations of the regular Opera PMS and ascend into the cloud. Experience unbounded potential as you gain exclusive access to the Opera PMS Cloud software available for you to use from anywhere, at any time. Through our self-study course, learners tap into comprehensive modules, including client relations, bookings, front desk operations, inventory management, housekeeping, financials, reports, and customer relationship management. Meet your expert tutor, Aditi Sagar, a dedicated professional and leadership development coordinator at the TCM Group, with a Master of Arts degree from Queen Mary University, London. Aditi's passion for learning and development has transformed hotel businesses and guest experiences. With her comprehensive training, you will gain valuable skills, acquire confidence, and elevate your professional capabilities. Throughout the course, practical assessments will allow you to apply your newfound knowledge in real-life scenarios using the cloud version of Opera PMS. Test your understanding with quizzes at the end of each module and a mock and final exam to evaluate your progress. Learning Opera PMS and gaining certification opens a world of rewarding prospects in the hospitality industry. Enhance guest experiences, establish the hotel's reputation, and manage hotel operations with efficiency. From front office manager to reservations manager, hotel general manager to hospitality consultant, the career opportunities are abundant. Join Global Edgelink's Opera PMS Cloud course today, gain hands-on experience with the cloud-based software. Global Edgelink, empower, elevate, excel. Um, hello everyone. Um, today we're going to start our webinar with the um, the power of Opera Cloud PMS. Um, we're going to talk about the uh, Opera PMS, how is, it is useful for the users and hotel operation. What is exactly Opera Cloud PMS? Uh, this is our agenda for today. Um, we're going to start with the um, icebreaker. Like I'm gonna get to know you, uh, each one of you, and then you will get to know me as well. And then um, we're gonna discover the potential of Opera Cloud for the hotel management uh, success stories of Opera PMS worldwide. Like how Opera PMS is moving forward into all of like and like mostly 90% of the hotels are using Opera. Then we're gonna discuss about better understanding on core features and benefits of Opera Cloud. And last, we'll, uh, we'll talk about the, um, the Q&A sessions. If you have any questions, I will be happy um, to answer. Um, so let's start with the uh, icebreaker. Um, I can see we have some of our attendees. Uh, Brown, can you go and introduce yourself? Tell us where are you from? Why are you joining this webinar? Hello, can you hear me? Yes. Uh, yes, Munir. I can hear you now. Thank you. My name is my name is Gulfam Munir. I am from Pakistan, city named Gujarat. I have been working in UAE for last three years. Well, in UAE. Yeah. Okay. And what did you what do you do exactly? Exactly, I am doing job as a customer service representative. Okay. And what are you expecting from? Uh, our webinar today, like what are, what are the I benefits? Want, I want to gain more knowledge. Okay, perfect. We'll make sure you get the uh, the whole knowledge you need. Yeah, thanks for your time and consideration. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you, Munir. Thank you, it's my pleasure. Uh, go ahead, Brown, please. Me? Yeah, me. Um, yeah, I um, was on looking for jobs on total job site and um i'm doing car park uh, attendant work at a race course in stratford and they mm -hmm. advised me that a good match if i wanted to do anything different would be hotel receptionist okay. so i've read two books on it and um i'm just looking for sort of like the computer desk reception desk computer systems mm -hmm. 
Uh, so he says that was a direct match. So. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Right. Um, Jennifer. Hello. Hi, uh, thank you for joining. Um, we're just uh, like I was asking to like introduce yourself. Uh, uh, tell us where are you from? What are the benefits you are waiting from this uh, webinar? Okay, my name is Jennifer. I'm currently in Toronto, Canada, and I have been working in the hospitality um, industry for some time. My department is with housekeeping. We've been using Oprah, but I Oprah recently moved to cloud, so I'm interested in knowing how the transition is going to be like and looking to learn more. Okay, we'll make sure you get this info. Thank you, Jennifer. Thank you. Uh, Toma? Okay, I believe she is disconnected. So uh, moving forward, um, actually, this is me. Um, let me like take you quickly through my journey. Uh, I am an expert in hotel systems, especially in the Opera PMS. Uh, I have worked with Opera uh, PMS in the old version, version five, and the newest version, which is the um, Opera Cloud. Uh, I have like 13 years of experience in the hotel operation and hospitality industry. I started uh, as a front office agent uh, in many uh, major chains like Four Seasons, Accor, and Hilton. And then uh, because of my experience in the uh, Opera PMS, actually, uh, I was able to join Oracle as an implement, uh, implementation uh, consultant. They actually taught me the uh, the technical part of Opera because I wasn't aware of the technical part. I was only using Opera as a uh, as a user, like doing the check in, check out, and and that's it. Um, once I joined Oracle, uh, I have done like many installations in Middle East, Europe, and and Africa. Um, where we actually installed Opera Cloud, uh, uh, do the trainings, show the users how they can use the Opera Cloud and what are the, the benefits and the differences between the Opera V5 and Opera Cloud. Okay, so now let's actually discover the, uh, the potential of the uh, Opera Cloud for the hotel management. Firstly, let's talk about Opera PMS. So basically, Opera PMS, is an opera property management system. It is like a, a hotel system where you can do all of kind of operations like a check-in, check-outs, make reservation, um, housekeeping, uh, revenue management, reports. Basically, it has tons of features that it can be used in the um, in Opera PMS. Uh, PMS, as I said, this is like an abbreviation for uh, property management system. Uh, I'm going to give you like a quick statistics about Opera, like 87% um, of the hotels worldwide are using Opera. There are different types of PMS actually, to be honest, but Opera is the only one which stands as a secure and reliable Opera PMS. So this is basically like um, a quick overview about the um, what is Opera PMS. What is the benefit of Opera PMS? One of the big features in, in the Opera PMS, it's, it's like, it shows you how to store or it lets you store all of the profile or guest profile you have in your property, which will allow you later on actually to check the, the, the preferences, what this customer or guest like, what doesn't he like, for instance, Let's say um, you, are, you are visiting or you are a, a regular guest in Marriott. So once you visit Marriott uh, for the first time, once they create a profile in Opera with all of your preferences, and in preferences, I mean like you like high floor, um, non-smoking room, um, you have a special allergy to one of the, uh, any kind of products. This is always stored in your profile. And then when you go to any other market in any 
uh, place in the world, they will know this info. This info will be stored in this database. So this is like one of the biggest um, features of Opera PMS. It only you allow you to handle reservation. Uh, you can check in, check out guest assign rooms, uh, check the rooms inventory. Uh, means like, you know, how many rooms you have available to sell, how many rooms are occupied. Um, so it's basically it will let you like accommodate everything in your property. So how this will help you, as I mentioned right now, like, like creating profiles, this uh, will make sure like the guest has a personalized service, personalized, personalized experience, because now I know what Brown likes and what he dislikes what Jennifer likes and what she like. So I get to know like what each and every guest in my property using Opera PMS, Opera Cloud, uh, all of the features they like and what the, uh, they dislike. So when you arrive at the hotel, you will feel like you are having a personalized experience because they already know. They already know what you like and what you don't like. Um, also, one of the biggest um, features or one of the biggest um, benefits of Opera Cloud, it's like it's connected with, as I mentioned in the Marriott example, it's connected with all of the database. Whenever you go any place, you will find your preferences and features are saved. It's all connected together. This is one of the uh, key features in Opera PMS Cloud. So let's go through the key features again. We have the reservation management. You can handle guest booking and reservation. Uh, you can check your availability, see how many rooms you have to sell in order to prevent any kind of overbooking and guest uh, dissatisfac uh, dissatisfaction. Also, on Opera, there is like um, an automated email. So once a reservation is created on Opera, an email goes directly to the guest from the hotel um, with all of your info, like welcome to our hotel. You are arriving on a this date till this date. Um, we are waiting you and so on. So this is one of the, uh, the key features of the confirmation letters going from Opera directly to the guest. Um, guest profile management, as I mentioned, the database, like all of your database is stored or all of your preferences are stored in the Opera database. So whenever any place in the world, your preferences will be there in the same chain. Uh, check-in and a check-out, you can also do like smooth check-in and a check-out, uh, do a room assignment. Let me tell you something about Opera Cloud. One of the features I like the most is called a schedule the checkout. Schedule the checkout, it means like um, you can actually tell Opera like tomorrow at 11 uh, a.m. Uh, Hatim will check out, his room will be checked out. So it's automatically at this time and date, the room will automatically check out from the system. If the guest is already like settled his invoice and folio and everything is settled. In this case, you can do a schedule checkout. Also, you can do like many checkouts together. Like you can check out up to 25 rooms together. If you are having um, a group in your hotel, a group with nine or 10 or 15 rooms, and instead of going to each and every room and check them out, you can like mark all of them and then quickly it's called the quick checkout quickly you can check it uh, check them out all right um also we have housekeeping and maintenance you can track the room status for the housekeeping um you can actually also um provide a task sheet for all of the housekeeping attendants in your property meaning like attendant one will clean for the daily cleaning for room number one, two, three, four, and five. And attendant two will be responsible for cleaning rooms uh, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. 
So it's actually personalized. You can uh, print out or you can do a task sheet in Opera Cloud and then hand it over to your housekeeping attendants to let them know what type or what rooms they will clean, what rooms they will do like turn down services um, and so on. So you can actually manage your housekeeping, manage maintenance requests, uh, which goes directly to the housekeeping or even the um, engineering uh, department. Uh, like if you have a, a broken lamp, uh, what a broken bed, whatever you have, you can track all of the issues you have in your room and it will be sent to the specific uh, or the certain department that needs to take uh, care of this issue. Billing and invoicing, uh, this is also like, um, on Opera, you can ensure accurate billing and invoicing for guests. Uh, and also we have Opera is one of the main or good or perfect features of Opera Cloud. It's easily can be integrated with many other uh, products. And I will get uh, through this point later on, but um, billing and invoicing, as I said, you can check all of the folios of your in-house guests um, departure guest, arrival guest, you can make sure you have a clear view of all of the folios, invoices, uh, the transactions done in his room, what kind, how, how much payment you need from him, and so on. Uh, analytics and reporting. Uh, believe me, guys, when I say, like, Opera has almost 500 plus reports. You can basically have report on every aspect, like guest in house, um, arrivals, uh, departures, um, housekeeping, uh, dirty rooms, clean rooms, um, revenue, like uh, the average daily rate, uh, occupancy, how much occupancy uh, do we have today in our property? Um, everything, like guest preferences, you can have a report about guest preferences. You can many reports on Opera. Even for a user, you have we have a very unique report, which is called like um, Journal by Cashier and Transaction Code. This report shows you all of the transaction you have done for today. Like what kind of transactions you did, how, uh, how much payment you took today. Um, have you done any kind of uh, refunds, everything. So this is regarding the analytics and reporting. Integration capabilities, as I mentioned, Opera Cloud is like, is pretty much integrated with everything like POS, uh, the, the, the POS, the point of sale, like if you have restaurants in your uh, property and then guest in house went to one of these restaurants and he had his lunch, for example. POS, the, the machine, which is in the, the restaurant, this POS is directly integrated with Opera Cloud. So if you took lunch with, let's say, um, 250, uh, 250 English pound, this lunch will directly go to his room in Opera Cloud. This is the, the kind of integration we have. It's, it's, uh, it's also integrated with telephones, the room telephones, like if you make an international call from your room, it will be directly in your invoice in the Opera Cloud. Uh, with many other keys, like keys interface, if you have an electronic keys, many integrations. This is what, like, uh, one of, like me as an installer or consultant, that's what I like about Opera. It's easily, we can integrate it easily with other products. Uh, guest communication, actually Opera, yes, it facilitates communication between guests and staff. Um, let me tell you something, Opera Cloud, this is a web-based uh, 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 application. Like you can access it from anywhere. You can access it actually from your home because it's basically a URL link that you put in your Google Chrome, Edge, whatever browser you are using. And then you can access it, uh, access the Opera Cloud using your uh, username and password. So it's not like the old version that, you should be on the hotel. It's only being used in the hotel. Nope, 
Opera Cloud can be accessed anywhere, even in your uh, mobile uh, uh, phone. So this guest communication, it actually facilitate the communication between guests and stuff. So sometimes this is kind of like um, also an integration or whatever the guest uh, needs, whatever he needs and whatever he like, it will be reported and implemented in Opera Cloud. So the staff later on can check it and see if he's eligible for any like um, service request inquiries and so on. Uh, mobile accessibility, as I mentioned, it can be used uh, from your mobile device for you as a hotel user and also for the guest. Like guest actually can, can there is like a development going right now with Opera Cloud that they can do like e-check-in, electronic check-ins through their uh, mobile phone. And once they did their check-in, it will automatically be reflected on your system, Opera Cloud system. Um, last thing, I believe security and compliance. This is the data, data security. Uh, Opera Cloud is completely, completely secured um, in regards to like um, sensitive guest information, everything. This is completely secured with Oracle. Uh, let me tell you like quickly before going to the benefits of Opera PMS, let me take, uh, take you quickly through like my job and what actually I do. As I mentioned, um, I moved from the hotel industry since I know Opera and joined Oracle. So we basically implement Opera Cloud like everywhere, to be honest. The feedback I got from the customers and in my, in my case, I mean customers are the hotels like a core um, um, a IHG Intercontinental um, and so on, that the, the, um, the feedback I got that they love Opera Cloud. It's better than any existing system they have, even the older version of Opera, because some of the hotels, we upgrade them from Opera version five, which is the oldest version, to the newest one, to the Opera Cloud one. Um, I have never in my life, like I have been in with Oracle for the last um, seven years, that I went to a hotel and they were, they didn't like Opera Cloud. It never happened. They are always like exciting about Opera Cloud, how they can access it uh, from anywhere, how it's user friendly. It looks, it's it's good to your eyes, um, and that's it. That's I, I just wanted to highlight the uh, importance of the. Uh, or the feedback of the customers I dealt with during my experience with um, Oracle. So now we're going to check the um, the benefits of Opera PMS. As I mentioned, uh, improved guest experience, and this is what I said that um, you actually can for your the preferences. As I mentioned before, each and every guest coming uh, to the property or to the hotel. Um, you actually save his preferences, what he like, what he likes and what he doesn't like. So it will be saved almost whenever he's come. And that's actually being used also for uh, the loyalty program or membership uh, programs. Um, also the smooth check-in and out, as I mentioned, we have the schedule uh, checkout, we have the group uh, check-in. So if you have like, and group coming to your property with 20 rooms, with one click, with only one click, you can check in all of the group to be in-house, and instead of going to one room and check it in. And then we have um, the efficient operations. As I mentioned, everything is smooth from front desk, housekeeping, maintenance tasks. There are um, reports that shows the staff what kind of maintenance and what room needs a maintenance. Um, also for the housekeeping, uh, if the front office agent or front office supervisor or the front office uh, staff leave like a trace or um, an alert or a comment on the reservation that this room needs to be cleaned, 
it automatically goes to the housekeeping department in their reports and their dashboard that this room needs cleaning. So this is one of the, um, the efficient operations we have. Um, as I mentioned for the reporting and analytics that you can almost see any kind of reports so you can have better decision uh, making like let's say one of the like the revenue manager in the hotel he needs to check um, what kind of market I am having in my hotel like what is the most uh, market like market in opera cloud means like sometime you have a um, something called fit market online travel agent uh, market like booking.com whatever sometimes the revenue manager needs to make sure what kind of market i'm receiving the most and what kind of market i'm not receiving so he start working to improve um his to, to like improve the market he's receiving, like to improve what kind of um, things he needs to work on actually to improve his the property revenue and so on. You can also track the occupancy rates, revenue, guest behaviors, because if you have like, as I mentioned, sometimes you have a troublemaker guest that came to your property and you would like to restrict him, like if he, to blacklist him, if he came to your property again. So there is an option in Opera Cloud that you can restrict this guest from coming to your property. So whenever he's trying to make any kind of reservation in your hotel, like a pop-up message will appear like, hey, make sure this take care, this guest is a troublemaker. So don't allow to make any reservations. So this is how you can actually track um, the guest behaviors. Also, this is this go for um, the regular guest, the VIP guest. Also, when you are doing a reservation, someone called you and he's making a reservation. And when you pull up his profile from Opera Cloud, you will find like a note that this is a regular guest, he's a VIP guest, please take care of him. Uh, assign him a perfect room, do some amenities in his room and so on. Um, the fourth thing we have of the benefits, the integration uh, capabilities, as I mentioned, uh, Opera is pretty much integrated with everything. Uh, PUS, uh, CRM, many interfaces like telephone, uh, VIN cords, electronic cords, everything. It's basically like, that's what I like the most about it. It's easy, it can be integrated also with the online bookings. So if you make uh, a booking on booking.com, Airbnb, Agoda, and so on, this booking will automatically be downloaded into Opera Cloud. Uh, and if you cancel this, it will also be canceled on Opera Cloud. So it's a two-way communication between Opera and any uh, OTA or online travel agencies like Booking and Aguda and so on. Uh, okay, so now we're gonna talk about the hotel that use Opera PMS. As I mentioned, uh, there is the Hansen uh, Hotel Group in Denmark, in Copenhagen, 12 hotels. Uh, from, actually from my side, I have, I have done like in the last, three years since Opera Cloud was developed by Oracle, I have done almost um, 50, um, 75 hotels uh, worldwide, including big chains like um, Accor, which is, is actually moving into Opera Cloud, all of Accor hotel worldwide in Europe, Africa, Middle East, uh, Latin, everything. They are moving into uh, Opera Cloud. Um, and we have done some local uh, chains going also to uh, Opera Cloud, including, including the Hansen uh, Hotel Group in Denmark, 12 hotels in Copenhagen. Um, they almost have 98 to 679 um, rooms. Um, actually, yeah, one of the points I would like to 
say like um, Opera Cloud can handle up to three, like I know there is maybe no hotel in the world that has 4,000 or 5,000 rooms, but Opera Cloud can actually accommodate this kind of rooms. I have done uh, one of the uh, properties in Kenya, they have uh, 1,350 rooms and uh, Opera Cloud was working smoothly. It was perfectly uh, very smooth, um, no lagging, no internet issues. Everything is fine uh, with the, uh, the Opera Cloud. We also have in a chill, um, some of the uh, Manicure hotels. This is a family owned hotel. Uh, they are expanding the operation to five hotels. They are, they are using um, Opera Cloud right now. Millennium hotels in Spain, they have 26 hotels in 12 cities across Spain. Um, they are now uh, using Opera Cloud and uh, Ojai Valley in USA also is using Opera Cloud right now. I can add uh, to these hotels, uh, Move and Pick, actually, they are using Opera Cloud as well. This is one of the uh, biggest chain. Uh, it's actually with Accor, Move and Pick. I have uh, personally, I have done many installations with uh, Move and Pick. Um, Banff Park uh, Lodge in Canada. Um, they are now compatible and they are using uh, Opera Cloud. So this will like show us why the hotels and like why the properties are moving into Opera Cloud right now. This will take us to all of the reasons I have uh, mentioned during my the last 30 minutes uh, about the functionality, about the uh, features, the key features of, of Opera Cloud, um, how it's like very user friendly. I don't know like guys, if one of you like already used Opera before the older version, uh, there is a huge difference between uh, the older Opera, Opera V5 version, Opera Cloud, and also between the uh, any other PMS, I have went to many hotels that that, that, that were using um, other PMS rather than Opera, not even the, um, the Opera Cloud, and they were surprised by the features and functionality that Opera Cloud has. It's it has many features. Like when it it it, it will take me like five hours to talk about all of. Uh, of Opera Cloud features, but it like like a quick wrap up for what I said. It's for each and every department. It's amazing. Like if you are a front office, it will make your life easier. If you are reservations, you can create a reservation just like this. Um, if you are a housekeeping, everything. Also, you know, for the housekeeping, there is a tablet that Oracle provides. This tablet is integrated with um, with Opera Cloud. It's actually designed for uh, Opera Cloud. What is the functionality of this tablet? Like, you know, each each day the housekeeping goes uh, for the, their daily cleaning. They go to each and every room to do their daily cleaning. So, you know, with this tablet, they can like put that I am as a housekeeper, I went to room 101, it was dirty. So I can, after I cleaned it, I can change the status to make it clean. Once I update the status on my tablet, it will automatically go to Opera Cloud as clean. Why is why I'm mentioning this? Because in other PMS, you will have to do it manually. So after you finish cleaning your room, you will have to call the housekeeping order taker or the operator and tell him, hey, I have finished cleaning this room. Please update the room status into clean. That that was a hassle. Like there was a communication. It was there was like a big uh, human error in this uh, process. So uh, or, like Oracle decided, why don't we make it with Opera Cloud? We we'll make it everything is automated. Like they take their tablet, 
they go into this room, they change the status. Also, this goes for the out of order and out of service as well. They can change it from their tablet. No need to call someone, no need to call the housekeeping uh, order taker or the operator to tell him it changed the room status. No, that's um, um, like that's the benefit of the uh, the tablet, the housekeeping tablet. Uh, so why is it, why is Opera Cloud is so popular? That's what I was saying right now. All of the features, the integrations, compatibility, functionality, the performance, security, and everything. And as I mentioned, the integration is very smooth with the existing and potential applications and platforms. Very smooth the integration. It, it doesn't take. Um, it's it's very easy actually to integrate between Opera and every day in Oracle. We discover by there are new products that can be integrated with Opera Cloud, and maybe in three or four days we know how to integrate this with Opera Cloud because it's very easy, as as I mentioned. Right, Opera uh, Opera Cloud is letting you to access all of its features. So, who should be learning about Opera uh, PMS? From my side, pretty much anyone can learn about Opera PMS, like whatever. The background you have, you can learn about Opera PMS. It's not that difficult. It's pretty easy. It takes some practice, of course, but it's like the concept itself. It's like very easy. Um, also, the individuals who are working in the hotel, and they need to up skill their um, skills to have a, a, a like a career growth. Um, so. That's actually what happened to me. That's what I like. I told you, I was a hotel user. I was working in Opera as a front office agent, and then when I learned and when I know, like there is, there was an opportunity with Oracle to be as a technical uh, consultant, implementation consultant. Uh, they took me actually. They took me because I have an Opera background. I know what's Opera. Maybe I'm not that good in technical at this time because I was just a user, but I have the basic knowledge. I know how to check in. I know how to check out. I know how to make a reservation. I know how to uh, assign rooms for all of the arrivals I'm having today in my property uh, reports. That's what they were looking for. So yeah, Oprah actually knowing Oprah uh, PMS will, will boost your career very much. And I'm, I'm talking about a, a life uh, example uh, in front of you. Um, also, the employees in, in, in the hotel, um, sometimes like we have different departments that we are not using Opera, uh, but by knowing Opera, by getting to know Opera, they will improve uh, their uh, career, their skills, actually. Uh, of course, if you are going to work uh, as a front office or reservation, housekeeping, whatever you need, of course, to know uh, Opera and, and master it, actually. If also you want to enter the hotel industry, uh, you are willing to work, you love to work with customers and guests, you, you like to provide uh, personalized uh, service to the guests, that's when you will have to like learn Opera Cloud. How is the hospitality industry uh, changing? As we mentioned, like um, the tech integration, now everything is cloud-based, uh, nothing, everything is contactless, mobile bookings and personalized experience. Uh, sustainability, increased focus in eco-friendly practices, reducing carbon footprints, so on, alternative accommodation, um like now yeah it's not only uh hotels are using opera cloud uh i have done many host hostels i have done also um apartments and villas i have done one in uh, in nigeria they were like they have 90 apartment and villas and they were implementing opera cloud so it's not only um hotel industry or um, hotels they are not only the only one who are using Opera Cloud. Actually, 
uh, hostels, uh, motels, apartments, and villas. Everything is you. Everyone is actually moving forward into the cloud uh, PMS, which is the uh, Opera Cloud. Um, the wellness. This is the hospitality trends in the world and UK wellness tourism uh, ground growing demand for wellness focused amenities, spa services, fitness, and so on. Uh, Actually, there is like um, an integration with Opera Cloud. It's called technically, uh, technically it's called HTNG. Uh, this is a spa reservation system, which is uh, integrated with Opera Cloud. So this is like this is what what I'm talking about. The integrations which is, can be done uh, with the, uh, Opera Cloud. How it's making everyone life easier. Uh, and then we have the UK uh, hospitality trends, staycation. This is a post uh, pandemic shift towards domestic travel, boosting local tourism and exploring a UK destination, green initiative, rising awareness of environmental impact leading to eco-friendly certifications, uh, tech innovation, integration of technology for online bookings, online check-ins and guest communication, so it will enhance our efficiency, culture, heritage, showcasing historic uh, sites, cultural attractions, and unique experience. Uh, I forgot actually to mention that in Opera, uh, in Opera Cloud, you can attach the uh, guest picture in his profile. So uh, that's like a personalized way of recognizing the guest and providing him also a uh, personalized uh, service. This this was not actually in older versions, or not many PMS has this uh, kind of function. But I find this kind uh, this function quite uh, interesting. Actually, to like uh, import his picture in his profile, so I can recognize him whenever I see him, and so on. So as we mentioned, uh, why understanding Opera PMS is important. As I as I as I said, it will uh, boost your uh, career. Uh, you will know about the hotel operation by automating tasks like reservations, in and out, housekeeping. Um, you can have a smoother day-to-day -day operations. So this is will all affect like the the one goal which is properties are looking forward to, which is the guest satisfaction. You can enhance the guest experience. You can access the valuable guest information, uh, preferences, so you can provide them personal, uh, personalized uh, services, which will lead to a happier guest and returning guests uh, to your property, which will increase your revenue, reputation, everything. Accurate decision making, as I mentioned about the reports that you have in, in Opera Cloud, you have thousands of reports that will take you like a whole insight about how your property is working, what you need to work, what you need to develop, uh, what you need to like, uh, how can you develop and all of this. This is the um, decision making by using the reporting uh, tool in Opera Cloud. Time and resource saving, as I mentioned, Opera Cloud is pretty much automated in many tasks like the schedule the check-in, um, uh, schedule a checkout, uh, quick check in, quick check out, task sheet for housekeeping, the tablet, all of this are time and resource, uh, resource saving for uh, the user and the guest and everyone. Uh, how P Opera PMS streamlines hotel operation, as I mentioned, automating and integrating with various tasks, including reservation, guest service, housekeeping, cashier and billing, uh, centralized information, you can enhance communication. Uh, everything like it's two ways like Opera Cloud deals with the hotel users. It makes your life easier and also for the customer or guest. It, it makes all of our life, the whole cycle is like easier. Um, adaption to industry trends. As I mentioned, Opera PMS integrates with other technologies uh, in Interdepartment coordination facilitates communication between different departments, such as front desk housekeeping, as I mentioned before. Front desk sometimes reach to housekeeping to clean a room, housekeeping reach to the front desk 
to tell them like the room is now clean and so on. Career advancement, this actually, as I, as I mentioned, this happened to me. Once I have Opera Cloud um, skill, I was able to, to join um, Oracle and boost my career. Competitive edge, today's competitive hospitality, updating uh, technology like Opera, set participant and establishment apart from other. That's why all of the, the world is going into uh, Opera Cloud. So I hope you are all ready to dive into the world of Opera PMS. Let's get started. Now uh, we are gonna take um, Q&A with me and Shalo. She is a co-advisor in Edulink. Um, hi, Shalo. Hi, Hatib. Thank you for joining. Thank you very much. Thanks for the insightful information there. So we uh, just open the floors for any questions if anyone has uh, any questions about what Hatim has explained about the, the Opera PMS software, how we can help your career, you can certainly raise them now. Right, so given that we do have another segment for question and answers, let me quickly take control then now and take you through a few things about a global edge link. Uh, the platform where we offer the Opera PMS software course for you. So my name is Shalu Rabel. I'm one of the course advisors here at Global Edge Link. And it's well, interesting to see a, um, an international audience here. We have uh, from Canada, from the UK, as well as from um, Pakistan, I suppose. So there's quite a lot. So thank you so much for joining us and taking the time to do so. Um, so giving a quick introduction to Global Edge Link, who we are. Uh, we are a leading professional accredited course provider, uh, authorized and certified here in the UK. Uh, we work with several um, different awarding bodies, uh, providing professional courses, vocational courses, and technical programs as well. Um, so we work with uh, Pearson B Tech, as well as ATHE, which is another uh, vocational awarding body. Uh, we also have human resources courses with CIPD, and there's also technical courses on IT services and several others. So there's a whole bunch, uh, over a thousand courses on our platform. And as you already uh, know that we do have students from across the world, um, so as because our subjects vary uh, quite a lot. So there's over 500,000 uh, students or counting really, so to our entire learning platform there. So we've been in the education services industry for over 10 years and have about 150 uh, experienced tutors uh, working with us. So that's quite an interesting uh, portfolio to share with you about us here at Global Edge Link. Um, so I want to also give you a quick uh, in information on why you should choose uh, Global Edge Link for your Opera PMS cloud software course. Um, so I'm going to quickly switch my slide over and run through a few important things that we cover in the course. Now, exactly as to what Hatling was talking about, so we want to give you uh, that hands-on experience covering the theory as well as the practical there. Um, so with our program, with all our courses most probably, we provide 12 months access. So you will be getting 12 months course access uh, to the Opera PMS Cloud course. Uh, in addition, we also provide you instructor-led live online sessions, which means you're able to attend sessions just like this one today. So you're able to raise your questions with the tutor and get them clarified. So that's part of our program there. And uh, we also provide practical simulation. So which means with this Opera PMS Cloud course, uh, you're also receiving uh, a provision for the software. So which is, you will also be able to try out the software uh, for a period of three months. Uh, so this is again, practicing what you've learned uh, on the course itself. So that is also included with our program for you. So we provide you video trainings, there's also mock exams. So there's a test uh, after each module to check your understanding. And then there's a, a summative exam as well that you can do, which then will make you qualify for the certification at the end of the course. So all of that is included. Um, so it comes as a package and there's a lot of information there. I think uh, we've been through all the, in the need for the Opera PMS. I'm just giving you an update on why choose Global Edge Link. So that's a quite a lot of things you can um, learn from us there. Uh, so what we can also do is go through our trust pilot reviews. If you can search for Global Edge Link, uh, there's a whole lot of reviews from our uh, learners. So you can understand as to uh, where we stand in terms of our course courses that we provide for you. 
Um, so I'm also excited to share that we do have special discounts uh, for those of you who participated in the session. Uh, we want to make sure that you sign up for the program and, and make the most of it. Uh, so I will also share the discount coupon codes at the end of the presentation. So this, uh, this session really, so you can make use of it and, uh, and you know, take advantage of our discount as well. So in addition, we also have payment plans. So if you are someone uh, who is interested, uh, you can yeah, you can certainly then sign up, get in touch with us. Obviously, I'll share our contact details, email address, phone number, and we can work with you on how we can work out a plan uh, that's more convenient for you. So about, apart from all this, there's also a bit of free courses we want to offer. So anyone who is interested in signing up uh, after the session, of course, there's about courses worth over 100 pounds. It's included with this program. So this course um, does include receptionist training. It has a telephone etiquette course. There's also a, a management course. And there's several others. So there's about, about three or four topics that we cover there. So um, those information is also available on our website for you to go through. So that's a lot of information there for you to take in. So I'll just take a breather. And uh, let's see if uh, some question, I think, on the chat. Um, oh, someone's asked whether we can share the, the recording of this webinar. Absolutely. This will be available for you. Uh, what we will do is at the end of the program, uh, we will share the information I've given you just about the discounts, the coupon codes. We'll also share the links to the recordings so you can go through them. Um, so that's, uh, yeah, that's about the benefits. And here's the reveal of the discounts there. So original price of the course is 359. This comes with 12 months access with all your your exams, your tests, uh, your certification is included, as well as three months access to the software. So you get to practice what you've learned in this time period as well. So all of that is available. Uh, but as, as a special discount for the month of September and for all our participants today, you can use this coupon code provided, uh, which then makes the course fee as £179. So that's uh, what you would pay in including, you know, to get everything that's I just mentioned. So that's the code for you to use MEP50, and that's a 50% discount as well. So that's, that's all the details there from me. So what I will be doing is uh, at the end of the session, I'm going to be dropping you an email. Um, right, so let's just see what someone's saying here. Right, so it's a problem with the voice then. Is that, is that better? Hopefully. Um, so yeah, what I'm going to do is just share the information to you by email. I'll get in touch with you, provide you our contact details and the links for you to go through the course. If you wish to go through a demo before you want to sign up, certainly please reply back and one of our course advisors will be able to share that with you. And uh, you can also um, raise any questions on the email and keep in touch. Uh, so that's it from me, and we probably are going to open the floor for further questions, if anyone has. Um, I think that's all the questions, and isn't it? So, so does anyone have any questions about the course platform, the course, or any other details you're interested in? Jennifer, I think I can see your hand raised. Uh, do you want to unmute yourself? Yes, hello. Hi, Jennifer. Okay, nice so I wanted to ask. Um, nice to meet you too. I wanted to ask, so does it mean the, the old platform will fade out and the cloud will take over or both will run hand in hand? Uh, yeah. so is that... Thank you. Oh, thank you, Chalu. Uh, yes, Jennifer, actually, um, by 2024, Oracle is going to like declare the end of life for the older version or for the part. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, my pleasure. So that's the, another reason for you to get upgraded then, isn't it? If that's the case, it happened. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's, it's about that. Um, that's it. So uh, any other questions in terms of the course? Now, how long do you, do you recommend having that this course? If someone's signing up for the program, you know, to take up the course, how long will it take for them to complete the course? Uh, is there a recommended period, you would say? Um, actually, it depends on the, um, like, his, um, what, what actually is going to do, like, is a front office reservation, housekeeping. Uh, it depends on what kind of um, information he actually needs, you know? Right, so uh, Jennifer has another question there. 
Okay, so like if you want to study everything in all the departments, like how long is it going to take? Or you have to choose a specific department to, to study? Uh, no, you can actually learn uh, about all of the uh, departments on Opera Cloud. Um, yeah, like it takes up to like two weeks, actually, to know about the uh, all of the departments, like the front office, the housekeeping, um, the revenue management, accounting, uh, blocks, every, every like to know each and every kind of aspect in Opera Cloud, it, it, will, it will take up to uh, two weeks and then you'll have to practice and do a lot of practice, to be honest, because it's not only theoretical, you know, this okay. is, you have to use it each and every day to get used to it. Okay, and the, the price, is the price for all the departments or is for one department? Oh, the course, of course, covers everything. Sorry, uh, sorry, I think I was just going to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I just thought it was uh, it's a question for the course provider. So, yeah, definitely, it's it's everything that's included, Jennifer. So, this price that I've been quoted is for everything, uh, as it is, this includes uh, your theory part of it, and also includes the simulation that we're providing you, which is a three months access to the software. Um, so, which is where, like Hakim said, you, you can try it out, and there's a lot of you know, practical that you need to learn. So this will be self-study. So you can plug and play sort of thing. Uh, so that's available for you uh, with the course. Okay. And it also states that it's instructor-led. So will it be like a live class or um, it wouldn't be a live class? Uh, so we do a combination, uh, actually. So we provide the self-study version for you, which is the, uh, the 12 months access. So you can you know, plan your study time as, as it is convenient for you. Um, so you can do that. You can always revisit the lectures, the, the videos and the notes. But in between, uh, we also conduct monthly webinars, uh, just like this one today. It's a live online session. So we pick out a topic and we do a discussion. Uh, so that will be, uh, it'll be scheduled out. So once you sign in, we will send you the schedule so you can pick a time that you can attend. So those are the live online support. So it will be constant. Uh, it will be just once a month on, on one particular topic, which you can attend for free uh, if you have signed up uh, with us for the course. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. I think that would be quite useful as well, isn't it? Because, you know, as it is while you're doing a self-study, if you have any questions, you note down. Uh, if you get a chance to speak to a tutor, you can get those clarified. So that will be an added advantage, really. Uh, yeah, Chalo, I believe we have a question in Q&A. Certainly. Uh, multiple choice exam, uh, interactive videos, tutor help if necessary, how I pay. Okay. Um, there's no written exam. Uh, so is, is it um, Alistair's question? Hi, Alistair. Thank you for joining us. So uh, the questions will be assessment. It will be assessment based. So it's not an assignment. Um, so you will have multiple choice questions uh, throughout the module just to check your understanding of it. Uh, and then there will be a final uh, test as well at the end. So it's just everything is online. Uh, there are no written exams, so you don't have to write an assignment. Uh, it's basically for you to learn how to use the software, what functions are available for you. Um, so that's the kind of test that will be. So it's the full exam. Uh, we, if you do fail, we do we can offer you a reset. Uh, there will be a cost associated with it. Um, unfortunately, at this time, I am unable to confirm that, but it won't be the full course. Uh, there will be an, a extra cost for you to redo the test. Um, it won't be the full course fee that you'll be required to pay, but we, we I can clarify that for you over, over an email at the end of the session. Uh, but of course, um, you can do that. You can repeat the test if you fail, but we do provide you uh, an option to retake. Uh, but the first attempt will be one that, and then for the retake, you'll have to pay additional. Uh, how do you pay for the course? Yeah, there's another question as well. So um, what I will do is I will be sending you uh, the course link. So all you have to do is just pay by a credit card, debit card, or PayPal. Uh, it's quite an easy system, really. And uh, you just click on the Buy Now button and you provide your details. And once you've paid, uh, we will receive a payment notification and then we can assign the course to your email address. So everything is online. So once you log into our learning portal, the course that you purchased for will be added uh, onto that site and you just start to track on the course, that's it. 
Uh, did it answer your question? Is there anything else I can clarify there? Let's It, so you can give us a thumbs up there. Uh, do we have another question? That's all the open questions, really. Yeah, perfect. Perfect. So that's that's about it. So we're kind of coming to the end of the session now. Uh, any one last question? Anybody um, you found the session useful? Um, you can give us thumbs up there just to let us know. And we will be conducting similar sessions um, on the course itself to give you a detailed understanding. Like I said, once you've signed up with us, uh, you can attend our monthly webinars uh, as well. So that's kind of it, really. So any any last words there, have them? Anything you'd want to share with them? Uh... Um, thank you, Chalu. Uh, no, just like um, like what I said, Oprah Cloud is coming. Opera Cloud is already the whole world is moving into Opera Cloud. Um, it actually helped me a lot, like as I was in front of the operation, then I moved to Oracle. So it's better, like you start getting to use Opera Cloud, know about it. It will boost your career, believe me. That's what I did. And thank you for joining all. Absolutely. Uh, thank you so much, Hatim. So, yeah, that's kind of the end of it. So, we've uh, run out of time as well. We're like almost an hour into the session, uh, but definitely this is not the end. Uh, if you feel you want to ask any questions about the product, about uh, the software, the courses we offer, or any questions, uh, please do get in touch with us. So that's our contact details. Uh, so, you can speak to either me or one of my course advisors uh, at Global Edge Link. So, that's our phone number. There's also a WhatsApp number or you can reach us on the email. Uh, but anyway, I'm going to be sending you an email as well, so you can always reply back. Uh, I will drop the course link, the discount codes, and also all the other options that's available. Uh, we will also share the recording of this webinar for you to go through um, at a later time at Leisurely. So those things are available. So if you also have any feedback, we will uh, share a feedback form with you. Uh, so please let us know what your thoughts are, what we can do to improve, or any new topics that we can introduce uh, in our webinar. So please share that as well. So keep in touch. Uh, thank you so much for taking this evening uh, to participate. Oh, there's another question from someone. Sorry about that. Uh, sorry, I missed that there. Can I use the teaching programs after failing an exam? Uh, absolutely. Like I said, the course access is available for 12 months, Alistair. Um, so you can revisit the lectures. Uh, if you want to redo the exam, we provide you an extension. So you can absolutely do that. So you can study and then take the exam at the end of it. But is it a very tough exam, Hatim? Do you think it's something that, you know, would anyone find it very difficult to pass? Uh, the exam, it's, it's very easy, actually. Yeah, no, no need to worry about the exam or failing. It's it's pretty much easy. Don't you worry about it. That's comforting. <laughs> That's comforting to know. So it's not going to be that tough, Alyssa, as it is. You know, uh, give it a try. There are mock tests, so you're not directly put into the live exam. So you can do the mock test, prepare, and then get to the final test so that it's not going to be that difficult. Um, we really have uh, people failing this. Of course, it's a new edition. So we did have a previous edition of the of the of prep AMS and you know, it, it just it doesn't happen as it is. We're giving you the simulation as well. So it's a lot of practice available. So there's nothing to worry. Uh, yeah, so with that confidence, uh, we will wind up uh, if there are no further questions. But thank you so much for everyone joining us uh, and you enjoy the rest of your day. And thank you. Bye.